Hi, this video will help you to set up Zoho Expense and QuickBooks integration. Let's head to Integrations and click on QuickBooks. Click on Connect to QuickBooks where you will be taken to a page where you can fill in your email address and password. Once you've done that, if you are setting up for the first time, a confirmation code will be sent across to your mailbox. Please make use of that. Select your company and authorize the connection. Please note that all your expense and cost of goods sold account from QuickBooks will be posted here as categories inside Zoho Expense. Your employees will be imported as submitters. Also, you can associate a QuickBooks customer to an expense or a report within Zoho Expense. You can configure how to export reimbursable expenses and non-reimbursable expenses to QuickBooks. Starting with how will the expense be exported, bill or a journal and choose an account payable account. You can set your bill date as expense date or report approval date or report submitted date. For non-reimbursable expenses, you can choose the default payment account. Since I have connected Bank of America with QuickBooks, it's displayed in the dropdown. You can also choose how to set your payment date, whether it's the expense date or the report approval date or the report submitted date. You can specify whether you want your submitter or your merchant to be the vendor of the expense. You can record advance payment under prepaid expenses or uncategorized asset or undeposited funds. You can select them and whether you would like to automatically export approved reports or you would like to do that manually. You can select them here and hit save. You have successfully connected Zoho expense account with your QuickBooks account. Now, let me create an expense account inside QuickBooks. Let's go back to Zoho Expense. To sync this new account immediately, I'm going to go to Integrations, QuickBooks Settings, and click on Instant Sync. When I go to Settings, Categories, I can filter it with QuickBooks categories. I can see the expense which I've created inside QuickBooks displayed here. Now let me create an expense using that account. I'm going to add it to a report. I'm going to create a new report. I'm going to set the duration. And I'm going to go to that report and approve it. Now, I'm going to export this report to QuickBooks. I can make use of this report number to search the bill inside QuickBooks. Let me add customers. When I go back to our Zoho expense account, I can see the customer in the drop down. I can select the customer and I can create an expense. In a similar fashion, the employees are created inside QuickBooks will be displayed here as submitters and you can edit the role and you can change the role. Thank you. If you have any questions, send it across to support at the rate zohoexpense.com for any further assistance.